So let's take a look at Tsai Yuan's thesis page by page. First off, we see that the title is Unfair Trade Practices and Safeguard Actions in a Changing World. Actually, there is no in a changing world. I put that in there for her. We'll see later on in her interviews that she likes to say in a changing world, but there is no changing world in the title here. Tsai has proven that she can't quite seem to remember the title of her thesis. So this letter is dated October 3rd, 2019. She gives thanks to her so-called thesis advisor, Mr. Michael Elliott. Notice the Mr. If Mr. Michael Elliott was her thesis advisor, doesn't he need a PhD? Why is he referring to him as Mr.? Of course, we know that Mr. Michael Elliott has no PhD. He appears to be appointed her thesis advisor after the fact because he passed away in 2016. It's possible Mr. Michael Elliott never met Tsai Ing-wen. So in this letter dated February 8th, 1984, reads, Dear Madame, I am pleased to inform you that the examiners for the degree of Doctor of Philosophy for which you are a candidate have reported that you have satisfied them in the examination. This is referring to her so-called oral examination, or VIVA. You see the title of her thesis there, Unfair Trade Practices and Safeguard Actions. I question the validity of this document because the examiners are not listed. When the school was asked who the examiners were, they simply said, this would cause distress to the person you are asking about. Why would revealing these examiners be stressful to Tai Nguyen? Do they really exist? Did she really take this oral examination? Acknowledgements is supposed to be with an S. She misspells supervisor here, and then Michael J. Elliott's name appears to be missing a T, which she typed in later on. You can see that the second T was not typed at the same time as the first T. Then she misspells the word meticulous and adds the S in later on. She's talking about the great proofreading done. However, we will see that there was not very good proofreading in this paper. So for the word regime, she inserts the letter S at the end. We will see in this thesis that she constantly changes words by retyping or by fixing mistakes with pencil. This could not possibly be a final draft. So these are the table of contents. Table of contents is supposed to be with an S. Export guarantee. She's supposed to say export guarantee. You can see this mistake constantly in her paper. And then temperate zone agricultural products. Temperate is misspelled. It's supposed to be T-E-M-P-E-R-A-T-E. -E -E. She misspells prerequisites here. It's supposed to be S-I-T-E-S -E at the end. So we can see that she put an I-M before properly because it was first written properly. Then she put an I-M to make it improperly. Competing is misspelled here. She wrote competiting. Not cost justified. Not cost is not a hyphenated word. The word there has been changed to be these. She inserted the letter N to infringement. Supposedly is missing the letter D. She's trying to insert the word bean, I believe. Far from being free of trade barriers. Sovereignty is misspelled. S-O-V-E-R-E-I-G-N-T-Y it's supposed to be. There appears to be a grammar mistake here. The ultimate aim of such arrangement. Such an arrangement would be correct. She appears to be missing an S after action. Should be safeguard actions by an importing country. Isn't safeguard actions the title of her thesis? Regulations appears to be inserted into the paper after the fact. Also up there, examine looks like it's inserted after the fact too. Non-discriminatory has been misspelled. She's writing discriminatorily. Access should have only two S's, not three. Leniencies is misspelled. It's supposed to be L-E-N-I. Import competing sectors. There's that competiting word again. She crossed it out there. Notably has two L's. It's supposed to be one L. The word now appears to have the W inserted later on. Profits has the letter S crossed out to become profit. Regimes is misspelled. It's supposed to be R-E-G-I-M-E-S. May lightened should be may lighten, I believe. Recession appears to have a letter whited out. The scale of social, the scale of social what? Social cost? There's a word missing here. We can see on the next page that the word cost is not written. Part 1, a world in transition. However, later on she calls it in a changing world. Somehow she got the name of part 1 mixed in with the title of her thesis. Separatism is not spelled with a V. We can see the word separatism with the V here also. Supranational is not a hyphenated word. 
It's one word. Available is misspelled. It's A V A I. Jamaica is misspelled. It's J A M A I C A. Until has only one L. Regard is missing an A. R E G A R D. In cooperative is uncooperative. It's supposed to be U N, not I N. This is a wrong word. Available is misspelled. It should be A V A I. Men's livelihood should be men's livelihood. Allocation apparently has an A written into it. Adjustment process has a comma after it that's written in. Profitable has a B written into it. Second should be secondly. Industries has an S added to the end. Worsen has an N added to the end. Environmental has an N inserted into it. Just below it, it also has another N inserted into the word environmental. Environmental with an N inserted into it. Again here. Again here. Standards has an A inserted into it. Worth noting is not a hyphenated word. Optimum tariff is misspelled here. You can see it's spelled correctly here. Superfluous is misspelled here. It's S U P E R F L U O U S. Emphasis is misspelled here. It should be S I S. Exempted should be exempt. This is a wrong word. Competing is misspelled again. She wrote competing. Guarantee is misspelled with a Q again. Separate is misspelled with an E. It's supposed to be S E P A. This is the most commonly misspelled word in the thesis. Ahead of environment. Instead is one word. She's made it two words here. Okay, we see Hue export subsidies. Does this mean high or huge? But it's definitely not Hue. H U G H. Technology is misspelled. There's no H after the T. Trigger price mechanism is misspelled. She's missing an R in trigger. Aligning is missing an N. Guaranteed is misspelled with a Q again. The should not be capitalized. Steel workers is not hyphenated. U.S. dollar is spelled with an O. Assault is spelled A S S A U L T. Exports does not have that O in it. She wrote flattered. I believe she meant flattened. Emphasis is spelled S I S, not S E S. Mediterranean is spelled with two R's, not one. Energy saving is misspelled. There's a G in energy. Energy saving is also not a hyphenated word. Steamed. I believe she meant to write steered. Menants is not a word. I'm not sure what she meant to write there. Strongly is spelled S T R O N G L Y. Free is misspelled. There's no R at the end. So she writes about the long-term cotton textile agreement of 1962. However, the next time she used the word agreement, she forgets to write the a and puts it in later. Mediterranean is misspelled again. It's two r's. Indonesia is misspelled here. It's e s i a. It's also misspelled here the same way. There's a t missing here and softening. The word r is crossed out. Referred has the last three letters crossed out to become refer. Non-tariff has a t missing. Export appears to be written S port, and she put a slash through the S to make it export. There's also a question mark right there. These are all indications that this is only a draft. Increases is missing the letter A. Tobacco has two C's in it. Institution has an S attached at the end of it to make it plural. Factor is not spelled with an E at the end. I assume she means factor. Has has an S attached to it. Time has a comma placed after it. Separate is once again misspelled. Quantitative is missing an A. Second should be secondly. Environmental has an N penciled into it. Environment has an N penciled in. Create is missing an E at the end. Nonconformance is one word and is not hyphenated. Environmental has an N penciled into it again. Sulfur is misspelled and corrected by pencil with a U. Efficiency is misspelled. It's E F F I C. Chapter one has been corrected here by pencil. Hidden has been corrected here by pencil. Environmental is missing an R and an N and has been corrected by pencil. The name Pearson has been corrected by pencil. G A T T S apostrophe has been put in by pencil. Introduction is capitalized. I don't think introduction can be capitalized like that in the middle of a sentence. Not sure what trade barrier ridden means. I don't think this term exists. Trade barrier is also not hyphenated. Balance of payments is not hyphenated. Same mistake here. Withdrawal is missing an A. It's D R A W A L. Contracting parties should not be capitalized. It's capitalized once again here. You can see that earlier here. Contracting parties is not capitalized. Contracting party is also not capitalized here. 
There's a great deal of inconsistency in terms of capitalization in this thesis paper. Movement should be one word. There should be no space between movement and the S. Agreement should be written with a T and not an R. Constituent has an S penciled in to make it plural. Result has an E missing. Government does not have an M at the end of the word. Reasonable is spelled R-E-A-S-O-N. There's an A missing in the word. Does no preclude should be does not preclude. Uruguay looks strange here. The U looks like it was typed in later. Cumbersome is not spelled with an N. It ends with an M-E. You can see the M-E penciled in there. Fictitious is misspelled. It's spelled F-I-C-T-I-T-I-O-U-S. Doctrine is missing an E at the end. Exemption is missing an E. It's spelled E-X-E-M-P. Avoiding is misspelled here. It's spelled A-V-O-I. Contracting parties should not be capitalized here. The needs an E at the end. Budgetary is spelled B-U-D-G. There's a D missing here. Self-financed appears to have a missing quote before the word. Applied has two P's in it. Extent is missing a T. Countries has a comma penciled in after it. Rule has a U penciled into it. Presumed has only one M in it. Signatories appears to have an S inserted at the front of it. Codes appears to have the letter C attached to the front of it. Throughout the paper, code is capitalized, but I'm not sure if you can capitalize it without writing out what the code is. I'm not sure what objective linked means. I don't know if that's a hyphenated word or not. This appears to be the word subsidies, but she wrote it with a letter A. Recommendations is missing the letter N after E. Automatic does not have the letter E at the end of it. Municipal is spelled M-U-N-I-C-I-P-A-L. Coercion is spelled C-O-E-R-C-I-O-N. On has an O attached to the front of it. The is misspelled. Brought is missing a T at the end. Illustrative list should not be capitalized. Cooperation is misspelled. It's C-O-O-P-E-R-A-T-I-O-N. Codes should not be capitalized. Contracting parties should not be capitalized. Committee should not be capitalized. General agreement on tariffs and trade has only two T's in it. Duties should not be capitalized. Material is missing the letter I. An should be A. Exporters has the letter S crossed out. Manufacturer has an R missing at the end. Committee has two E's at the end. Apparently the word and was inserted after practices but was later crossed out. Separate is misspelled again. It's S-E-P-A. Code should not be capitalized. Commission should not be capitalized. Community should not be capitalized. Code should not be capitalized. Separate is misspelled once again. Standard is spelled S-T-A. The is missing an E. Responsibility sharing is not hyphenated, but there's a hyphen penciled in. Subsidized is spelled S-U-B-S-I. Subsidized is missing an I between D and Z. Trademarks is one word. Uncertain is spelled U-N-C-E-R-T-A-I-N. The code should not be capitalized. Simultaneous is spelled S-I-M-U-L. Provisionally is spelled P-R-O. V-I-S-I-O-N-A-L-L-Y Separate is misspelled again. Federal is crossed out. Trade has an A penciled into it. A should be N. Subtracted is spelled S-U-B-T. There is no S between B and T. Chapters has an S attached to the end of it. Arguably has only one L, not two. Practice is missing an A. Prerequisites is missing an E between T and S. Intermittent is missing a T at the end. Barriers is spelled B-A-R-R-I-E-R-S. Condemned is spelled C-O-N-D-E-M-N-E-D. State-controlled economy does not have a hyphen between controlled and economy. Countries is spelled C-O-U-N. Competing is misspelled. It's C-O-M-P-E-T-I-N-G. Intermittent is missing a T at the end. Legislation is spelled L-E-G-I-S-L-A-T-I-O-N-S. Fairness is missing an S at the end. Producers has been crossed out. State-controlled economy does not have a hyphen between controlled and economy. There is no hyphen between non and state and non-state controlled. There is no hyphen between non and state controlled. The hyphen between state and controlled 
has been penciled in. There is no hyphen between control and economy. There is no hyphen between market and economy. This quote between normal value should be followed by another quote after the word value. Application is spelled A-P-P-L-I-C-A-T-I-O-N. That exports in developing countries sell their manufacturers at prices lower. Using the word manufacturers is awkward here. Perhaps she could use manufacturing or manufactured products. Determination is missing a T before I-O-N at the end. Investigation is missing a T before I-O-N. Dumping has been crossed out and injury has been penciled in. An L is missing between B and E and responsible. The word evidence is missing the letter E at the end. Understanding should not be capitalized. International should be capitalized in International Trade Commission. Czechoslovak is spelled C-Z-E. Czechoslovak is spelled V-A-K at the end. She gets Czechoslovak wrong at the beginning of the word the first time and then she gets it wrong the second time at the end of the word. Degree has an E missing in it. Czechoslovak is finally spelled correctly here. Czechoslovakia is spelled correctly here. If I was her examiner, I would give her two PhDs for this. Challenged is spelled C-H-A-L-L. Domestic is spelled D-O-M. Causal is spelled C-A-U. Usually is spelled U-S-U. Explanatory is spelled E-X-P-L-A-N. Serious is spelled with an S, not a D at the end. Zinc is misspelled with an E at the end. It's spelled Z-I-N-C. However, she gets it right later in the paragraph. Regard is spelled R-E-G-A-R-D. There's a missing R here. Provisions is spelled S-I-O-N-S at the end. Ames has an S added by pencil. Sources has an S added by pencil. Insufficiency is spelled C-I-E-N-C-Y at the end. Usually is spelled U-S-U-A-L-L-Y. There's an additional S here. Attempt is missing a T at the end. Marginal is spelled M-A-R. Complexities is spelled C-O-M-P. Environmental has an N inserted by pencil. Competitiveness has an S missing at the end. Import competing is misspelled. It should be C-O-M-P-E-T-I-N-G. Practice is spelled P-R-A. There's an R missing here. Investigation is misspelled. It's I-N-V-E-S-T-I-G. Production cost based is not hyphenated. Provisional is missing an A between N and L at the end. Instrument is spelled I-N-S-T. Subsidy is spelled S-U-B-S. Guarantee is spelled with a G, not a Q. Guarantees has an S added on to the end of it. Further is spelled F-U-R-T-H-E-R. Effects has an S crossed out by pencil. Benefits is spelled B-E-N-E. Establish has an H at the end of it. Brought has a T at the end of it. Brought has been spelled here again. Void is spelled A-V-O-I-D. Reality is spelled R-E-A-L-I-T-Y. Conclusion is spelled C-O-N-C-L-U-S-I-O-N. Safeguard is spelled S-A-F-E. Amendment does not have an A right there. It's spelled A-M-E-N-D-M-E-N-T. Permissible is spelled P-E-R-M-I-S-S-I-B-L-E. Adjustment is spelled A-D-J-U-S-T-M-E-N-T. Arrangement is spelled M-E-N-T at the end. Arrangements is spelled A-R-R-A-N-G-E-M-E-N-T-S. Abandon is spelled A-B-A-N-D-O-N. Until has an extra L at the end. That's not supposed to be there. In, I-N should not be capitalized. The has a missing E at the end. Provisional is misspelled. It's P-R-O-V-I-S-I-O-N-A-L. Applied is spelled A-P-P-L-I-E-D. I see a total of five spelling mistakes in this sentence. It might be the worst written sentence in the entire thesis. Concrete is spelled C-O-N-C-R-E-T-E. Subsidy is spelled S-U-B-S-I-D-Y. Violation is spelled T-I-O-N at the end. Pressurize is the wrong word. Pressure is correct. Serious is spelled S-E-R-I-O-U-S. Hypothetical is spelled I-C-A-L at the end, not O-C-A-L. Percent is one word. P-E-R-C-E-N-T. Serious is spelled S-E-R-I-O-U-S. Percentage is spelled P-E-R-C-E-N-T-A-G-E. Non-discriminatory is spelled N-A-T-O-R-Y at the end. 
This A has an N penciled at the end of it. Circumstances is spelled C-I-R-C-U-M-S-T-A-N-C-E-S. -E Softening is spelled S-O-F-T-E-N-I-N-G. Difficult is spelled D-I-F-F-I-C-U-L-T. Consumers is spelled C-O-N-S-U-M-E-R-S. -E Coercion is spelled C-O-E-R-C-I-O-N. Softened is spelled S-O-F-T-E-N-E-D. Vulnerable is spelled V-U-L-N-E-R. Restraints is spelled R-E-S-T-R-A-I-N-T-S. -E Here are the footnotes of the thesis. I suspect that parts of this thesis have been plagiarized because she can go for pages without spelling a single word wrong and then spell several words wrong in one paragraph or in the same sentence. However, to confirm my suspicion, somebody has to look at some of these sources which I'm not going to do. The writing seems to have two personalities. One is of an English as a second language student, and another as one with quite strong English. So this is very confusing. Either way, this is definitely a draft and could not be turned in to receive a PhD at the London School of Economics or any other reasonable university. It is also rather doubtful that a person of this English level could get a master's degree at Cornell too. I believe that this is an unfinished thesis and was never meant to be shown to the public. However, under pressure from the public, Taiwan the presidential office released this online, but I believe that it is evidence that she did not complete her PhD. It's also possible she was never in the PhD program to begin with. This can be inferred from the level of her English we can see in this paper. Perhaps it's time to start an investigation on her master's thesis at Cornell. Does she have a thesis written at Cornell?